what's up guys to my friends and welcome back to my channel so today i will start my vlog right here under the rain with cajeta, chocolate, peach, apple, strawberry, uh, raspberry, pineapple, tejocote, orange, mango, lechera, it's like condensed milk, and guava. Or you can combine them. Um, yeah, there's much more Nutella and all of that. So you can fill them with all of these if you want. One for 20 if you want the traditional ones or one for 25 if you want these special ones like these special teas. Alright guys, so I chose Sarsamora. Sarsamora is raspberry, so it'll be two raspberries. So this is what you love begin and this is sweet. This is um, in other words tamarind covered with this and they have other traditional Mexican candy sweets and over there they have my favorite ones. Those are delicious. Now I don't know if I should buy these right here or I should go to another place. Um, what do you think about it? This one costs 25 pesos. Should I buy it? ¿Quieres uno? No? Um, okay, never mind. I'm not gonna buy it. I think I'm gonna buy one of those. Ooh, guava, rompope. ¿Qué es de rompope? ¿Cuánto cuestan estas? 20. 20. Me das una de rompope y una de nuez y de coco. ¿Qué es de café? Oh, no, mejor me das ajá, una rompope y café. Ya no más dos. Ok, nada más esos dos. ¿Por esta? All right, guys, so I bought these two, coffee and rompope. And it's 20 pesos each of them, so 40 in total, which is like $2. That's yes. Right here we have the whole corn and then over there they have the ramen mar maruchan and then over there they have the esquitas so shout out to you Burma Records You're telling me that I can choose whichever I want so let me see uh, 
del rojo. Este mira, del. De Flaming Hot. Los morados. Pasamos los flamingos. ¿Es amarillo? Con que está tiernito, está bien. I am telling them to get me the most tender one because obviously I can't be eating um, very hard corn. So they gave you the option whether boiled or the grilled that one. Listen. ¿Eso también? Sí, por favor. Se lo voy a dar un plato porque está muy tierno. Alright guys, so here I have my elote con chile, mayo and cheese. And I tried it already, it's good. But nothing compares to this one right here. This one is so delicious. This is white corn. This costs 45 pesos mexicanos. And it tastes good. I feel like the one that I tried last night at a at Tizocalo was a bit better than this one. But the one that I really like, this one, oh my god. These are esquites. Esquites, okay? And these are cooked no, with no, no, other seasoning. And it has cheese. I think it has, yeah, two types of cheese. And it comes with these Doritos. Wow, they're delicious. I love them. No oigo nada. Te llamamos de Garibaldi. Para que escuche los mariachis. Ah, ratito, vamos a ir a Garibaldi para que escuche los mariachis. Mm. Okay, so I'm gonna go into this store, Bazar Coyoacán. Because I saw a lot of really cool stuff. Exactly. Huh. Okay. Yes, it's nice. Oh, look at these. Oh my god, I have a lot of stuff in here. Oh, I like it it's in This one's really nice. ¿Cuánto cuestan estas? Okay. I have this one, Frida. This is from Ghana, Africa. Pretty cool. Everything is cool. Huh? Someone's in love. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Ah. <laughs> Someone's blushing. Ooh, girl, let me see. Ay, qué rico. Sí, te gusta? Oh, they're so cute. Look at those over there. ¿Cuánto cuestan esos? Estos están en 180. 180. Oh, we bears. Oh, it's so cute. Okay. Okay. Los precios ahí. Sí. Angel. ¿Y este? Este es de 300. Está muy bonito. Tengo esta libreta que es de hoja cuadriculada. Ah, ok. Hoja de puntos y hoja de puntos. Mm, ok, ok. Gracias. This is the Coyacan Plaza. A lot of people come here because there's a lot of stores, um, very good places to eat. And when it's a when it's a nice day, during the day time, um, all this plaza looks really nice.
There you have the Mercado Artesanal Mexicano. That's the market of artis or artisans. Okay. Tacos, pozole, what else? Tortas, el comalito, tepos nieves, they have ice cream. I want an ice cream. What else? Ooh. What is that? Paletas, helados. This is coffee from the old town. Hmm, okay. I need to get my cafe de olla. <laughs> where, where do I get it? It looks good though. Huh? Oh, let's see right here, Emma. Let's, let's check out those bracelets. We're still looking for a bracelet. I love them. Oh, that's the that's the one you got yesterday. Kind of, kind of. Verdad? Sí. this one well they got these magnets right here and they represent the place where I'm at right now and this is really nice it's from Cuyacan this one is from Bellas Artes and that's the one that I got right now let me see your bracelet no it's nice I got this one let me show you Bro. yeah thank you I got this one they love to come to this plaza it's one of the most visited plazas here in Coyoacan, in Mexico City, my bad. Let me show you more of the plaza. They have this really nice fountain that's off, of course. <laughs> I always wanted to come here because I always see other YouTubers coming to Coyoacan, right? I was like, I gotta go there one day. Right now, we will um, take a taxi, a cab, and we're gonna head to Garibaldi. Garibaldi is where all of the mariachis are. <laughs> And that's where I want to go because I love mariachi. Um, so, yeah, we're gonna get the cab and then I'm gonna take you guys over there. And we're leaving Coyoacan because there's a lot of people, but it's too dark right now, too late. It's better when you come early in the day because you can see everything, everything is open. You know, right now it's open, but you have other options, and that's what I want. Huh? Those are the coyotes, the most famous and known fountain of Coyoacan because of the coyotes. Um, Coyoacan comes from the, from the word coyotes. That's why they have these coyotes right here. It's really nice. Oh, they have more apples, like the ones that I, the one that I bought earlier today. I'm for kids. Manzana? Okay. Gracias. Yay, because why not? My sister, shout out to you. Thank you. She bought me another apple, like the one from earlier today, but now we got a blue one. The first one I got was red, and they said it was from Cham it was of chamoy, but I don't think it was chamoy. It tasted more like chili piquín. Yeah, yeah, it was spicy. This one is blueberry. So yeah, let's see how it tastes. I will wait for a better place to try it, somewhere where it's uh, much more calmer. This is another street of Coyoacan. In Spanish, we call it Callejón. Callejón. Because it's a smaller street. Okay, and they have lots of restaurants over here on the other side as well. They have gelato, ice cream 7 Eleven, a bank. They have everything. You will find everything, absolutely everything in here. 
some tacos. Okay, like I told you guys, we're still looking for a cab. Um, I just asked for one of these cars that I thought it was a cab, a taxi, but it's not. It's only by app. But since we have no connection, of course we don't have no application to order to get a taxi, an Uber or something. Therefore, we have to wait for another taxi of the city. Uh, but yeah, there's nothing. Nothing. You see? I don't know. We should wait now. So the my taxis. And they're waiting for us because my <laughs> it's not raining anymore. She still has her cape. Okay, um no? <laughs> Okay, I think they're waiting. They're waiting for us in Garibaldi. Um, my auntie and her family. So we gotta get a cab and then we're gonna go to Garibaldi and we're gonna spend some time with them and it's gonna be our first time, Bella. It's gonna be our first time in Garibaldi. I'm so excited. So we arrived to Garibaldi. Garibaldi is where all the mariachis are. And you can clearly see them over there. Tequila. Dijo que enfrente. We found my family over there. This is the Tequila Museum and they have lots of restaurants over there and of course you can drink tequila and your mari mariachi. Oh, that's so cute! Que bonito! Digo en 100? 100 pesos. It's gorgeous! It costs 100 pesos. Si, negra, no? I love it! It's so pretty! They just bought me this. It's gorgeous. I love it. Keep moving like the scars 